Hello, and thank you for choosing Harold G. Shavitz Industries, the sensor connection. Today we will demonstrate how to test a linear potentiometer sensor. To perform this task, you will need the following tools and materials. A DC power supply. A DC voltmeter. A linear potentiometer. A 4 inch long insulated copper jumper wire, stripped about a quarter of an inch at both ends. A 3 wire linear potentiometer circuit is a variable voltage divider. As the wiper moves along the resistive element, it provides an output voltage proportional to displacement. The full scale output voltage is equivalent to the excitation voltage. For example, an excitation voltage of 10 volts DC would produce an output of 0 to 10 volts DC. Begin by attaching the jumper wire to the negative terminal of the power supply. Next, attach the sensor's positive excitation wire to the positive terminal of the power supply. Then, attach the sensor's negative excitation wire to the negative terminal of the power supply. Connect the positive lead of the DC voltmeter to the sensor's signal output wire. Connect the negative lead of the DC voltmeter to the jumper wire that is attached to the negative terminal of the power supply. Set the voltmeter to measure DC voltage. Set the DC power supply to 10 volts DC. With the linear potentiometer fully extended, the voltmeter should display 10 volts DC. With the linear potentiometer fully retracted, the voltmeter should display 0 volts DC. Thank you for watching this instructional video. For additional technical resources, please visit our website at hgsind.com. Harold G. Shavitz Industries, performance and reliability is our business. Thanks for being on our team.